Hello everyone and welcome to Sun Codex. In that video I showed you how to switch between ambient sounds using a trigger box and a crossfading system, which is a great solution when dealing with complex spaces. Today though I'll show you a much quicker and easier solution that uses the ambient zone settings built in the audio volume. So without further ado, let's move to Unreal and see how it's done. To begin this technique, we need to import a audio volume so you can move to place actors and search for audio volume and drag and drop it in the viewport. Make sure it has the same size and shape of the volume where you want this technique to be applied. I have already done it and this is my audio volume. Now make sure we have an interior sound, in my case ambient sound 2, which is a violin playing, and an exterior sound which is outside the audio volume. And make sure that they have at least a low spatialization checked on, otherwise this technique won't work. Now select the audio volume and scroll down until you don't find the ambient zone settings. Here we have a bunch of parameters such as exterior volume, time, low pass filter, low pass filter time. These defines if we can hear sound where, whether we are inside or outside uh, the audio volume and if so how do we perceive these sounds. If you want to do a very straight and defined transition like a sort of switching sounds on and off set exterior volume to zero and interior volume to zero. So when you are inside you won't hear anything from the outside and vice versa. Now we need to create a new sound class. To do so go to add import then select sounds under classes and select sound class. I have already done it and this is my new sound class, it's called test sound class. Double click on its icon and you need to check just one thing which is apply ambient volumes. Then make sure to save and move once again to the viewport. Now we need to select the two ambient sounds, the interior and the exterior one and we need to apply the new sound class to these two guys. So we can do it in two ways. The first one is search in the search detail for class while still having your ambient sound selected and you'll find the sound class override voice. Or you can search uh, for it manually under sounds. At the very bottom you, you'll see this little arrow click on it and you'll find it. So once you are here in sound class override you can click in the drop down menu and search for new uh, sound class. Here it is, test sound class. Now both of the ambient sound have the test sound class applied. So the last thing we need to do is to build the geometry. As always, thank you for watching this video and see you in the next one.